William Barker is 73 years old. His wife is dead. He has no other family. Now his money is gone. Today he must find shelter in a charitable institution. But this morning, before he goes anywhere, Mr. Barker has an appointment he cannot miss. Like the many who can't afford the care they need, Mr. Barker depends on a clinic supported by the United Fund. 600 people every day from every part of our community. Six hundred strangers, part of a big family. It's when you need help that you find out what kind of family you have. Like blood from the Red Cross, a stranger's blood to serve a stranger's need. That's the test of a community, the way it takes care of its own. Mr. Barker's appointment is at the tumor clinic in the Barnard Free Skin and Cancer Hospital. They use a betatron to help him, an atomic instrument to fight the cancer under his skin. The great enemies of age are disease and loneliness. Today, Mr. Barker's club has its meeting. A bad day to move. He really shouldn't take the time. But maybe just a minute wouldn't hurt. The Golden Age Club at Kingdom House meets just once a week. But these few hours are important to Mr. Barker. It's a good feeling to belong, to just sit and watch and know you're among friends. And once in a while, take a look at the younger generation. The Kingdom House Day Nursery is one of 10 supported by the United Fund. So much to learn when you're young. So much to remember when you're old. But today is moving day, and he better get on. It's hard for an old man to learn that he can't trust his own ears. It must be harder when you're young. Play with Dick. At the St. Joseph Institute for the Deaf, Play children learn to hear with, with their eyes. Tom and Dick play baseball. Okay, Joni, you try. Tom, I Bad with Dick. Tom and Dick. Bad. Baseball. Baseball. Baseball hasn't changed much since Mr. Barker played. The kids from the South Side Y still play the same game. You can't help but envy them a little. Mr. Barker usually stays to the end.
but not today. Only there's a friend he wants to see first at the rehabilitation center in the Jewish hospital. Mr. Barker planned to tell his friend about where he had to move, but it doesn't seem so important now. His friend is busy too. It isn't easy for an old man to keep trying, but there isn't any other way. It's no use putting it off, Mr. Barker. It's time to go. William Barker is 73 years old. His wife is dead. He has no other family. But today he has found a new home. Through the United Fund, this community takes care of its own.